Welcome to Heritage Auctions November 2014 event, Selections from the Eric P. Newman Collection Part 5, U.S. Coin Signature Auction. The floor session is on Friday, November 14th at the Waldorf Astoria in New York, followed by a special signature internet session on Saturday, November 15th. Lot 3024 is a famous colonial rarity, the 1785 George Washington Confederatio Copper graded BF30 by NGC. This classic copper was just the second known example according to Sylvester S. Crosby, who notes it was obtained around 1820 from the toll gatherer at the Charlestown Bridge in Massachusetts. The coin then passed into the collections of Loring G. Parmalee, James Tenike, Waldo C. Newcomer, B. Max Mayle, and to Colonel E.H.R. Green before residing in the Eric P. Newman collection. It is a legendary colonial issue, the third finest of just six known examples. Lot 3025 is an early pine tree copper from New Hampshire graded VG8 by NGC. The simple design is pure rustic early Americana depicting a tall pine tree with the legend American Liberty. The reverse shows an Irish style harp with the date 1776. Although Walter Breen lists six different varieties, this is the only design considered to be a genuine New Hampshire copper. Surviving examples are extremely rare. The coin is cast rather than struck, as are all authentic pieces. This example appears to be one of three coins in private hands. Two other examples are unavailable to collectors, entrusted to the American Numismatic Society Cabinet and to the Smithsonian Institution. Lot 3036 is an extremely rare example of the 1776 Continental Dollar struck in brass. It is the beaded rings variety graded AU50 by NGC and we believe it is the second finest of just three known coins. The coin is clearly the Newman 1A variety with fully beaded rings as compared to the Newman 1B variety which shows the reverse die modified to use lines instead of dots to form solid rings. To the best of our knowledge, this is only the third auction appearance in numismatic history of the brass 1776 Continental Dollar with full beaded rings. Lot 3167 is an outstanding example of the 1794 Silver Dollar, a coin with an impeccable provenance and undeniable charisma. This coin has not been available for public sale since it entered the Colonel E.H.R. Green Collection and it was previously in the strong hands of Matthew A. Stickney. Samuel Hudson Chapman and Major Richard Lambert. Natural gold, blue, and iridescent toning near the borders surrounds attractive silver gray interior areas of the coin. The strike is far finer than usual with a bold date and complete stars on the obverse. We believe this to be the 13th finest of all documented $1794. Lot 3311 is a beautifully preserved 1795 Eagle, the 13 leaves of variety, graded MS62 Plus by NGC. The coin is semi-proof-like with mirror-like fields on each side. Original deep orange and gold hues cover the warm golden surfaces. Purchased by Eric P. Newman from Abner Kreisberg nearly 50 years ago, this coin is fresh on the market and is an exceptional mint state example of the first gold eagle produced by the U.S. Mint. Lot 3377 is one of the most amazing Liberty Head double eagle coins we have ever seen. It is an 1867 dated coin with the unheard of grade of MS66 by NGC. To say this is the finest certified example of the date does not do it justice, since it exceeds the next finest example by a full three grading points. The average certified grade at PCGS and NGC is 56.6 for the date, nearly 10 points less than this premium gem. It is a coin for the finest collection of Liberty Double Eagles, a piece that is impossible to duplicate for quality. Bidding is now open for this auction. The floor session is Friday, November 14th at the Waldorf Astoria in New York. For more detailed descriptions and images, log on to ha.com slash 1215. Thank you for watching and good luck.